<laughs> I don't like this. I don't like this at all. Uh, what is going on, everybody? My name is Jacob Forster, and welcome to a new little indie horror game. Today we have Hush Little Baby. And you know what? This is something I have not done in a very long time. Over on itch.io, usually you could just sort by popular or new and popular games that are coming out, cycle down by horror, and just kind of find some good ones, but... I used to love just going into the just released section and just start browsing through games and see if anything looked of interest. I have no idea if this is gonna be any good. This was released like less than 24 hours ago, but it looked somewhat interesting to me. So I thought I'd check this all out and have you all come along with me. So let's go ahead and start this game. See what this is about. Um, oh. I guess we're in a hospital room? Baby? Watch TV or stop? What? What? What is happening? I guess I'll go upstairs. Is there a baby? Baby? Um, rock the crib. This is bizarre. This is, okay, I, <laughs> I don't know if I like this. <laughs> there you go, little baby. There you go, hush. Hush, little baby. You know, I'm gonna, I think I'm gonna turn off the TV here. Or I guess I can watch it. I don't know what these different options do for me. Oh, baby's crying again. Baby, I'm coming for you. I'm coming for you, baby. Don't you worry. Um, mm, I'll comfort you. Time to comfort the baby. Oh, yes, 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 yes. Gosh, that's an awful sound. <laughs> Children just crying and screaming. Okay, but we comfort them. Can I go outside? What's over here? Nothing. Uh, use. H Hello? Oh, okay. Nope, nope, baby's still crying. <laughs> what is this weird little world that we're in? Time to feed the baby. What happens if I just stay with the baby the whole time? Maybe I should play the lullaby for him. I'm gonna stop the TV, because it's, it's strangely loud. Stop it. No, I can't stop it. You can only just watch the TV. What if I try to interact with the phone again? Wait, can I sit down on the couch? No, no, no. All right, baby. Baby? Uh, I'm gonna play a lullaby for you. He likes his lullaby. <laughs> it's a little creepy glitchy. There you go, baby. Just for you. Just for you. All right, baby, I'm trying to watch this great news show. I'm gonna watch this TV. I'm trying to entertain myself, have a great time. You're just up here crying, screaming. Oh yeah, I knew it. See, I knew it. I knew he was gonna start crying. Use nightlight. <laughs> Excuse me? <laughs> what are those things? I guess baby likes it. Baby does really enjoy this. I don't know if I enjoy it though. <laughs> they kind of look like, remind me of the Sour Patch Kids. <laughs> Excuse you? <laughs> Excuse you, I didn't, I didn't like that. I didn't really like that. I'm gonna watch some more TV. We just have a random timer to watch TV. Should I call someone? I'm gonna call somebody. <laughs> hey, honey! The baby won't stop freaking out! Okay, let's go back up. Let's go back up. Baby. Oh, I just fed him. Okay. See, baby's just fine. Baby's just fine. As long as we feed the baby, everything will be a okay. I feel like this is one of those games where there's a bunch of, like, secret stuff going on that we just don't know about. Curious what else I can potentially do here in this world. Hello? Answer. Eve, it's me. Okay. I would have contacted sooner, but this is it difficult for me to say? You're gonna think I'm crazy. The other day when I was babysitting, something weird happened. I saw and heard things in that room. Strange things I can't explain. Then there was a voice inside my head. It told me it was going to kill me. Like, how is that even possible? I don't know. Maybe I was just hearing things. I had some wine. 
Yeah, I'm probably just being silly. Mama. Eve, are you there? <laughs> um. I don't. Oh, I don't like the baby anymore. <laughs> oh gosh. Oh. <laughs> what? I'd like to leave, please. <laughs> um, hi. <laughs> oh, this is bizarre. This is very bizarre. <laughs> hi. Oh, 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 I don't like the way you move. I don't like the way you move. I'm gonna leave. I'm gonna leave. Big oh! <laughs> go, go, go! Oh my gosh! Get out of there, get out of there! <laughs> come on, come on, come on, come on, keep going, keep going, keep going, keep going! <laughs> go, go, you! <laughs> oh, I don't like this, I don't like this at all! Can I answer the phone? Can I answer the phone? It won't, it won't let me answer the phone. Where am I? <laughs> this is great! This is great! <laughs> Hello? Somebody there? Don't leave me. I I'm gonna get out of here, man. This baby's freaking me out. What if I keep knocking? It'd be nice if I could... Sprint. Who was that? What was that? What does it say? Knock will they. They will knock? Is it backwards and upside down? Or read the wrong way? They will knock. Oh. Okay. If you leave, you will die. What are you talking about, huh? What are you talking about? I'm behind you, Mama. No, please. Please, no. Please, please, no. I I'm just gonna keep going. I'm not gonna look behind me. Exit down here. Okay. Let's go down the stairs. We gotta leave. We gotta leave. <laughs> this is great. I, I did not know what to expect with this game. There I'll show you all the, the, the itch page when we're done playing. It is so bare bones. But there's something that just kind of drew me to this thing. <laughs> Come on. Keep going, Eve. Keep on going. Her name was Eve, right? Or is it Ava? I, I don't know. It's, I think it's Eve. <laughs> I don't know where I'm going. I don't know where I'm going. I'm a little nervous. Because we're not seeing anything. I feel like if I turn... I was going to say, I feel like if I turn left, it's just going to be the stairs immediately. Here lies Eve Clark. Oh my gosh! A 29-year-old local woman was found dead on the streets earlier tonight. She was found just outside of her apartment. Her cause of death is currently unknown. End C. What? What? Developed by Giggles Games. Very interesting. I have to get these other endings now. What? Thanks for playing. Thanks for making such a cool game. Let's go ahead and do this again. Ah, uh, this is very impressive. I I did see. Oh, I can't even go until the baby cries, huh? What if I just ignore the baby? Just let the baby cry. Just kind of do my thing here.
<laughs> yeah, what if, what if I do absolutely nothing? But yeah, I did see that this developer also had one other game here on Itch, and it was a demo for something that they're releasing on Steam. It's like a, it's an it's a RPG inspired by like Undertale and Earthbound, but has horror elements to it, which I guess is kind of kind of like Undertale. Um, hi, baby. What if I just what if I just stay here? What if I just don't do anything? I, I'm gonna see what happens here. I'm gonna sit here and drink my not sponsored Coke Zero, mm. and just wait. Uh, I'll probably cut to see if anything happens. This might take like 50 minutes. Who knows? <laughs> okay, there doesn't seem to be anything happening, and this is just so annoying. Let's see what options I have. So nightlight, read story, comfort, rock crib. I'm just gonna use a nightlight immediately. See what happens. So I wonder if the other endings are getting caught by the baby, rather than making it all the way back. So I need to know, I really need to know what happens in this, with the other two endings. And, and I'm only assuming there's three. Look at these little cute things. <laughs> what are they supposed, what are they supposed to be? I don't know. Watch some more TV. Yeah. Let the time go by. Surely nothing bad will happen. Let's watch more TV. We love TV in this house. Oh, baby, I'm coming. I'm coming, baby, I'm coming. Don't you worry. I'll play your lullaby. I don't like the lullaby. <clears throat> Perfect. Ah, uh, look at baby. All safe and sound, all quiet. Time to watch more TV. On tonight's Wednesday news report, we have just heard all the singing about you. You don't like singing about you anymore. Oh, baby, come on! I don't even know what's going on in the world anymore. Just want to know the news. Uh, let's. What happens if I use the nightlight again? Is this different, or is this the same as it was? <clears throat> Either way, I don't like them. You know what I'm realizing right now? The effect, that there's a fuzzy, grainy effect happening on the screen. <laughs> and I think it's shaped as if we're watching an old glass screen tube TV. Um which is interesting that they put this filter on specifically. It's like some strange, deep things going on in this. Let's go to Ricci's story. Once upon a time, there was a child who was willful. She would not do anything her mother wished. For this reason, God had no pleasure in her and let her become ill. No doctor could do her any good, and in a short time, she lay on her deathbed. She was lowered into her grave. The earth was spread over her. Suddenly her arm came out again and stretched upwards. They put it back in and spread fresh earth over it. But it was of no use, because no matter how many times they did this, every time the arm came out again. Then the mother herself was obliged to go to, her, go to the grave. She struck the arm with a rod. Only when she had done that, it was drawn in. At last, the child had rest beneath the ground. <laughs> what a bizarre... Our story. <laughs> Anyone there? Nobody's there. Let's watch some more TV. Baby, oh come on, baby! I just started watching. Time to go back upstairs. Hello? Here, I'll feed you. I'll feed you this time. Give you some. Uh, I'm assuming milk. At this stage, you're just a you're just an infant. Maybe just a month old. Maybe even less. Maybe more. No one really knows. Let's watch TV. What if I don't, oh, what if I don't answer the phone? Okay, there's baby. Let's rock the crib this time. We gotta do like one of each to see if there's anything different. Actually, I'm curious. I think for the third playthrough, I'm gonna see if there's multiple stories that are told. Okay, there's the phone call. Um, 
ignore. And watch. Oh, they're calling again. <laughs> Sorry, I can't be bothered. Baby is asleep and I'm not answering this phone call. Ignore. That's weird. That's like an old computer. Like, like my mechanical keyboard. That's the only, one of the only times that you hear that. This is in the menus. So that, that's, a, oh, I can't do anything until I answer the call, can I? All right, all right, we'll answer it. Eve, it's me, we'll contact you sooner. Yeah, 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 yeah. Something weird with the baby, saw and heard something in that room. Strange, I can't explain it. It told me it's gonna kill me. I don't know, maybe it's just hearing things. Had some wine? Yeah, I'm probably just being silly. Mama. <laughs> Mama. Eve, are you there? What if I try to use the phone? Okay, can't do anything at the moment. Oh, I forgot about that. Let's go, let's go. Forgot, oh my gosh, I keep forgetting. <laughs> All right, okay, so into the weird world. Let's get back to the baby with the creepy hand. So I just instinctually started holding D to run to the right, but I don't know if that was a cutscene or not. So I'm not gonna try to run away from the baby's arm that's coming out of the crypt. It's coming out of the crypt, stop that, you weirdo. Baby? <laughs> oh, it is killing me. <laughs> what is happening? What is happening? You can walk away from the hands. Did I break it? Oh, stop that. Stop it. Okay, just keep going. <laughs> yeah, there's the hands. Oh boy. Oh my. I hate it so much. I hate it so much. Okay, so you can't go back. <laughs> I hate it so much, I can't answer the phone. Okay. What if I knock at least three times on each door? Would anything change? Would anything change? This game has some great sound design with these strange effects and that, man, that baby crying and so creepy. <laughs> okay, let's go to this one. Knock three times just to just to see, just to check, see what's going on. I, I'm because there was a weird figure that was off to the right that we saw. Yeah, that one. <gasps> Is that supposed to be the Grim Reaper? I'm just now realizing that. They will knock. I don't like it. I'm scared. <laughs> if you leave, you will die. So when should I turn back? Nobody. Okay. Keep going. Keep going. I'm behind you, mama. mama. Oh my! Oh my gosh! Oh my gosh! Let me! Let me out of here! Let me out of here! Look at its little fingers! Look at its little fingers! They let me in. They let me in! I do not like the sound in here. I'm trying to see if I'm like seeing stuff in the static, by the way. 
I, I don't think I am, but my, my face is thinking that something's happening. We're moving. We sure are moving. Just keep walking, just keep walking. Uh, hello. Can't interact with it, perfect. Keep walking, keep walking, we got this. Everything's fine. The mother has arrived, as was foretold. Prepare the ritual, for she is here. The blood will spill, and he will consume. <laughs> I'm sorry, what? <laughs> Eve Clark went missing on the 22nd of December between 9 p.m. and 9.16 p.m. After the police search went cold, her father hired a private investigator. The PI found traces of a strange cult. His whereabouts is also unknown. Ending A. Interesting. So I bet the second ending then is going to be... I bet the second ending is not going in that door, but continuing off to the left. So I'm going to do a... I'm going to test a theory right now. And uh, go and read the story. Once upon a time, there's a child who was willful. Okay, so this is the same story. Child became ill, went to the grave. The hand kept coming up. The woman struck it with a rod. Very weird story. Very, very bizarre story. So I want to see if the story changes doing the storytelling once more. Come on, baby. There you go. There you go. Once upon a time, this child who was willful. Yeah, this is the same thing. Okay. Yeah, I was curious if there's gonna be anything different with the story itself, but it doesn't seem like it. So let's just go ahead and get through this again, and uh, I won't have you all watch this game for a third time in a row. Um, we'll just get back to the part where we're leaving before we go to the, the headstone. So, see you there. Okay, we're getting back to the little location where, yeah, it says, I'm behind you, mama. Mama. Okay, so I'm not gonna knock on the door this time. Mama. Oh, I hate that. <laughs> I hate that so much. So I'm just gonna keep walking left and see what happens. Mama. So they will knock. That's the one that uh, goes to the cult. So what happens if it keep moving? Where did, where did the baby go? I don't see baby. I don't see the baby. Where are the baby's hands? S stop it. Where did they go? Is he behind me? Oh my gosh! Baby? Put to sleep. Okay, this is all new. So this is the second ending, or was this the first ending? I don't know. It's, it's a different ending, that's for sure. Police discovered a grisly crime scene earlier this evening. 29-year-old local woman was arrested. She was found at the scene, rocking in the corner of the room. Beside her in the crib lied her one-month-old boy. He was no longer breathing, and paramedics were unable to save him. Eyewitnesses reported the woman screaming, it's coming for me, as she was taken away. Ending B, there we go. Oh, that was great. That was a great little horror game. Giggles Games, very, very well done. So this is, this is the itch page. As you can see, there's, <laughs> there's only one person that's played this 11 hours ago. Um, this was just uploaded or published a day ago. And I was like, oh, this looks really, really cool. Um, it, it literally went off of just these three scre screenshots to be like, you know, I'm gonna check this game out. And I am so glad I did. And, and I did, I was mentioning before, I saw that they had this other game that they're putting onto Steam called Data Break, which again, has kind of a similar style, uh, stylized choice. But again, they said it was kind of more of a Undertale kind of style to it. And there's a, there's a demo for it available, so I might I might actually 
check that out here um, just to kind of see how it is. And if it's anything like this game here, uh, I'm sure I'll have a really, really great time with Data Break. But uh, yeah, this was Hush Little Baby. Very, 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 very impressed by this by this little game. So, I, gosh, I, I don't even know what to say. Like, it's just so fun to, to find new games like this that are just kind of hidden. Um, so I hope that this developer gets a, a bit more push. And again, by the time this video goes out, there's probably gonna be a lot more people who've seen it and have checked it out themselves. But I hope you all enjoyed this one. If you did, make sure you hit that like button. Leave a comment down below. Love to hear any thoughts and feelings from y'all. And if you're not already subscribed, consider doing so. Hit that bell notification that we know exactly when I'm uploading any new videos. And if you'd like to see any more content from me, you're welcome to follow me on any of my other socials like my Twitch, Twitter, Instagram, got a Discord channel, and a bunch of other cool things always listed in the description down below. But of course, that all being said, you all are awesome. You all are amazing. And I cannot wait to see you all in the next video. Later.